Hello guys, welcome to my YouTube channel once again. This is Tech PB. Thanks for joining me. In this video tutorial, I'll take you through how to create a YouTube channel and then also show you how to upload your content, your videos onto your YouTube channel. In the process, I'll show you how to create a YouTube banner and then a YouTube profile picture so that you can use it on your channel to make it more enticing to make it more advertising so the first thing we'll do is to go onto the youtube platform by typing the youtube.com to open the youtube website then on the top right hand side you want to click on the sign in and to sign in to youtube so you want to sign in with your google account or if you, if you are if you find yourself on a on a MacBook or an Apple device, you would probably be signed in already using your Apple ID. So I'll go ahead and then sign in with my Google account. I'll sign in. Um, you may have to type your email address and then also type your password. In my case, I had already signed in before, so it remembered the email address. So I'll type the password quickly to sign in with my so once signed in, I'll click on the account icon on the top right hand side and then click the creates a channel. And then you'll be presented with this pop-up window and with the channel name, a suggested channel name, which you can change. Uh, you can clear what is there and then change it. You can it's and then also it gives you the handle, the YouTube handle that you are going to use going forward. You can change it to whatever you, you want, but just make sure that it is not being used. So once it checks green, you are good to go. You can create, you can click on the create channel. After that, you see that um, you, you'd be given a message that um, your channel is being created. So check back in a few moments, just give it some time and then refresh the page once a while and then you would see that your channel has been created just as we are looking now or just as we are watching in this video now so you can click on the that arrow sign to view the more details on your channel the date you joined youtube um, it being today's date this is the day I, I created a channel. So, so you can customize your channel by changing your profile picture. So I'll click on that, click on continue, and then it will bring you to the, it will take you to the channel customization. Uh, under Brandon, you would see um, the picture, the profile picture. You can click on the upload to upload a picture onto your profile picture, your YouTube. Um, profile picture you can also click on the upload beside the banner image to upload a banner onto your YouTube um, channel to make it more enticing to make it more advertising to draw the attention of uh, people or viewers to your channel so you, under basic information you can edit the settings we saw uh, earlier which is the channel name the handle you can also type a short description or a summary of what your channel is all about um, you can see the channel url which you can share with your friends and colleagues you can also type uh, an email address um, as a contact so back under branding um, i will show you how to create a profile picture and then also create a banner image to use on your YouTube platform. In this same video, using an online tool known as the Canva. I will make the, so over here is the, the site I will use to create the profile picture. I will make this um, link, I will make the link to this site in the description i'll make it available in the description of this video so i'll click on the create a profile picture 
And then back under branding, you see that it says that the picture shouldn't be more than 98 by 98 um, pixels. So on Canva, by default, they give you, when you click on the create profile picture, they give you the exact size that YouTube requires. So you can select any of the templates on the left and then um, you can edit them you can change the colors the background you can change the images you can add your own images and then you can go forward so you can select elements on the left and then you can search for whatever your channel is about if your channel is about books if it's about computers if it's about food you can select it in my case i selected computers i search computers and then I've, give, I've been given um, templates of computers I can use as my profile picture. So you can go through them and then select which one you prefer. So the, the templates with the pro icon on, um, you have to pay a premium before you can use them as your template or as your, as your profile picture eventually. But I, will select one, I selected one of the few, uh, the free templates and then you can use that or you can click on the text to add a text as a as a, as, as a profile picture edit it you can, in my case i will select the the templates and then edit the text so i will edit the text to anon p i will change the color of the P to purple and then this is just for test so it's not nothing serious so once done you click on the share click on download and then make sure to leave it on the PNG file extension so select that and then click the download button to download your YouTube profile picture so yes, it says you, it's best to use a PNG or a JIP file. So we downloaded a PNG file, which we will use later. So once the profile picture is created, we'll go on to the other Canva um, sites where we we'll de design the banner. So you can see that with the banner, the edges are extended because um, the banner is wider than the profile picture. The, the, the requirements on YouTube is wider. So um, just as I did with the profile picture, I'll select one of the templates and the texts. You can search for whichever one you want in the search box, and you'll be given the results. I will change it once again to Anon P, change the color of the P to purple, by clicking on that, then selecting the color I want. Once that is done, I'll click on the share button once again, and then click the download button, then make sure that it is set on PNG. Click the download button once again to download the image file. And then once downloaded, you want to put them in a location so that you, you can easily browse to them and then use them as your profile picture and then a banner. I'll click the upload button beside the profile picture and then I'll quickly browse to where I, I saved the pictures. So I created a, a, a folder under pictures and then I put them in there. I'll click, I'll select it, upload it, and then I'll click the done. Once you click done, you, you can see that it's been changed to what you just what we just uploaded. So I'll click upload under or beside banner image, select the banner I created, and then uh, once you are comfortable with your you are okay with the view of the banner, you can click the done, and then you should see, also see it changed over there. So you can actually click on the change to change it later on or you can also remove them so once you are done you just click on the publish and then you will be published 
onto your channel everything will be changed on your channel so you can change them you can remove them later on when you have better ones good looking ones click on the view channel and then you should see the changes that you made to your profile picture and then your banner um, appear so that is that with the profile picture or the channel customization we customized it so going forward um, we want to click on the channel icon or to 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 create to upload videos or to upload your content you can click on the create down there or you can click on the channel icon and then select YouTube studio so I selected the YouTube studio because this is the platform where you get control over what you have in on your channel you can see that you can you have your channel dashboard um, you have your channel analytics you have a summary you have your top videos so you can click the upload video if you want to upload your content or your videos and then select your videos and then upload them you can also uh, upload videos by clicking on the creates button on the top right hand corner and then select the upload video and then that's another way of doing it so under the creates button you can upload videos you can go live you can create a new playlist or you can um, create a new podcast so what we want is to upload a new video so you click on that select then click on select files then once the browse window opens you can browse to your video and then upload them you can also click on the upload button um, down there with the arrow pointing up and then go through the same procedure so i'll use that and then select the video i want to upload it's a short video i i created just for the purpose of this video and then once done you click the upload and then you should see this window come up when it comes up under details or the title just um, give it a title this is what um, um, your viewers will be searching when they search that's the title that will pop up for them to know um, or for them to watch your video so I'll type um, that um, title for the purpose of this video I typed um, how to create a YouTube channel and upload videos and then also um, you can add your description and then there's also thumbnails you can add a thumbnail you can add um, a, a playlist we don't have a playlist now so a thumbnail is a catchy image you put on your video to attract viewers when they see it um, they get attracted they, they get enticed to click on your videos so you can create one and then put it on there so once you have your title you have your description you have your um, thumbnail so I tried um, going into the thumbnail but it says I have to verify my account before but I'm not ready to get into that but in your case you have to verify your account it's not it's not um, difficult it's very easy so going forward just select no it's not made for kids or if your video is made for kids you can select um, yes it's made for kids but in my case it's not so I'll select that and then select the no don't restrict my video to people people who are 18 years and above make sure that you check that um, no there are no issues with your video and then click next once you click next just click next again click next and then over here you can select the private to save the video as a private uh, video you can select the unlisted but when you want to the whole world to see your videos you, you have to select the public and then also if you want to set your video as a premiere so that you can premiere it at a later time you can select that but in my case i want to publish it right away so i'll select public and then 
Um, once everything looks good, I will click the publish button to publish the video so that the whole world can see and watch my video. Once that is done, this will pop up to share your video with WhatsApp, Facebook, um, X, formerly Twitter. You can even share it via uh, email and those other social media apps. Click the close button to close um, that. And then once you do that, the, 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 the video that you just um, uploaded should show under your, on your dashboard under the latest video performance. You can see your channel analytics, which shows that um, you have zero subscribers. Um, under the video, the latest video, you see the performance of your video. You can go to the videos analytics. You can see comments on the, that video, that latest video that you uploaded. So that is your YouTube studio for you. You have the dashboard where you see all those information, the summary of the last 28 days. And then you also have the contents where you will see all your videos, the videos that you've uploaded. And then also we have the analytics. The analytics show you the performance and then the activities of your videos. So you can see the views your videos have gotten for you. Um, you can see the watch time in hours. You can see the number of subscribers you have under analytics. This is a new channel, so those options are grayed out. But in case you, your, your channel is older, you will see them act, active. So you can view comments on your videos by selecting the comments um, section. You can, if you have any copyright issues, you will see it under copyright. And then if you want to monetize your channel, this is where you come to view the information. The end um, section. So um, to become a YouTube partner, you need to have at least a thousand subscribers, which is one of the requirements. And then any of the other two, the first being 4,000 public watch hours in the last 365 days. Or you could also have a thousand, at least a thousand subscribers and 10 million public short views in the last 90 days. Of so the, the last 90 days of um, your channel's existence. So those are the requirements to becoming a, a partner of YouTube. So you have to make sure that you, you have a two-way or two-step verification turned on. You follow the community guidelines and that you don't have any um, YouTube strikes or anything like that. So basically, um, that is it with um, this um, video. So again, under content, the channel content, you can click on playlist to see all the playlists you have. You can click on podcast to see all your podcasts. You can see, you can click on live to see all your live streams. You can click on shorts to see all your short videos. And then the main um, tab is the videos tab where you have your um, videos with longer duration. So yes, guys, click on the subscribe button down this video to subscribe to my channel, Tech PBA. Click on the like button if this was helpful. And please click on the share button to share this video and then I'll see you in another video. Bye.